and now we're going to choose to create a new virtual machine. And we're going to choose, I will install the operating system later. I'm not sure why that uh, fixes the problem, but it certainly does. So we'll go ahead and browse to that location once again. And we'll choose the VMs folder next. And we'll do the stores a single file one more time. Finish. And now we'll start it up. And we'll go over to player, CD, disconnect, player, CD, settings. And then we'll choose our ISO file and click OK. We do want to make sure where it says player, removable devices, that CD is checked. Because even though we've attached the ISO file, unless that box shows is checked, it's not necessarily going to be on. So let's go back and restart one more time. And we've now gotten past the error. And we can go ahead and choose the installation that we want and continue on. Now Windows is installing.